Former President Donald Trump's campaigning in Arizona today, while Vice President Kamala Harris is in the battleground state of North Carolina. Now the election is just over three weeks away. CBS's Natalie Brand brings us the latest tonight on the race to the White House. With 23 days to go, the presidential candidates are holding dueling rallies in key battleground states. Former President Donald Trump appeared in Prescott Valley, Arizona, where he focused on an issue central to his campaign, immigration. When I win on November 5th, the migrant invasion ends and the restoration of our country begins. Vice President Kamala Harris returned to North Carolina as the state struggles to recover from the devastation caused by Hurricane Helene. Moments of crisis, I believe, do have a way of revealing the heroes among us, the angels among us, and of showing us all the best of who we are. New CBS News polling shows a stark divide between Harris and Trump supporters on issues including hurricane relief, with most Trump supporters believing the false claim that relief funds are going to people not impacted by the hurricane. On the economy, Trump voters overwhelmingly call it bad, whereas most Harris voters call it good. It all underpins this idea. It's not just competing ideologies going forward. It's different views of what is right now in the country. Overall, the CBS News poll indicates the race remains very tight, with Harris three points ahead nationally and holding a one-point lead in battleground states that could determine the election. Natalie Brand, CBS News, Washington.